Well, uh, recently I um, put a video up about uh, Faulty Towers and about John Cleese uh, planning to reboot the series. Anyway, that looks as though it's not coming about. Anyhow, I did mention to you that I have the discs of Faulty Towers on DVD somewhere or other. Um, now, a while ago, um, I was at a boot fair and I picked up this audio collector's edition of the BBC TV series. And um, it some of the episodes have been re-edited for audio because the BBC had put them out on um, uh, CDs before anyway. Um, many years ago. The original character for Basil Fawlty came about when John Cleese uh, wrote an episode of uh, Doctor in the House. I think it was 1971 and this one was set in the CD hotel and the character that be later became Basil Fawlty was played by another actor anyway. Anyway, the seed was planted in Cleese's mind and when um, when he parted company with the Pythons, uh, he decided, he and his wife, Connie Booth, at that time, to uh, get together and uh, write a series. We know there are not that many episodes, but still. Anyway, I bought this box set, Car Boot Sale, Collector's Edition. Now, it should have been uh, seven discs in total. But unfortunately, there's one missing. I'll come to that in a bit. There's an interesting booklet here with details and the various whoops, episodes uh, all in there and the cast list. Uh, it was only when I went, went through it recently I discovered that I'm one disc missing. But there you go anyway. Uh, there, there is a super collector's edition that's out a very expensive uh, vinyl set which I don't have and no intention of buying anyway uh, CD1 when, when I, I noticed that disc 3 was missing I thought oh this is this is sort of an ironic joke played by uh, Cleese or something to miss that out to wrong foot you um, it's got um Tracks 1 to 10, A Touch of Class. Then the next episode, The Builders. I remember all these quite clearly in here. Uh, disc 2 covers uh, The Wedding Party. And uh, the next one, The Hotel Inspectors. Now I should have disc 3, which is missing. And uh, that, that should um, cover... Uh, the Germans and um, Gourmet Night, or Gourmet Night, as some people put it. Anyway, uh, I'll come to that in a minute. Um, this Disc 4 has got communication problems and The Psychiatrist, broadcast in 1979. Disc 5 uh, has uh, Waldorf Salad and the kipper and the corpse then we come to uh disc six this is where it gets a bit strange um the anniversary and basil the rat then there's this bonus disc and it says um interview tracks one to ten interviewed with prunella scales and Andrew Sachs. These interviews are also available on Faulty Towers, DVD, Digipack, blah, 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 uh, Faulty Towers Series 1 and Faulty Towers Series 2. So, haven't heard, haven't heard the, those bits anyway. Told you about the booklet. Now, the ones that I'm actually missing are on this two cd set actually and they should be the same um same editions just in different format uh this one uh, um, has the kipper and the corpse which is on there and uh, it has waldorf salad which is 
on there. The ones that are missing with that disc that I've not got uh, is uh, the Germans and Gourmet Night, as I touched on. So, in effect, I've not really lost anything. Just a bit sad that it's not there anyway. Somebody's probably lost it or whatever. And uh, this one, it says uh, BBC Worldwide Limited, 1994 to 2002, these editions. Uh, this recording was previously re released on cassette in 1994 and 1999. So it's probably exactly the same, just in a slightly different, slightly different uh, casing, etc. So there you have it. Uh, there's my um, Basil Faulty collection. Well excluding the dvds which i've got somewhere or other uh, in fact my son has just bought it on blu-ray would you believe very posh uh it's not often to lend them to me anyway so i don't know um if there'll be any benefits possibly the pictures slightly better but otherwise i've still got my dvd version anyway hope you've enjoyed seeing this if you have please click like and please hit the subscribe button because it be nice to have you on board and i can keep showing you all the wonderful things that my wife would like me to part with uh, and you can enjoy them anyway without having to put your hand in your pocket or even spend a penny on them thanks for watching